be here with my friend Sam. Um, if you don't know Sam, please introduce yourself to my name is Beverly, please pay attention to Natra. So Sam um, does a lot of work with oil and gas. Um, you may know oil news Kenya. He's the genius behind it. So we're headed to Rome right now. We're going to be going to a world site and then we're also going to be doing a bit of community engagement. So this is going to be really exciting. Yeah? And every single not the best at this, but hopefully when the trip takes off, you'll get better. Push them. So we just got to Lamu um, via Malibi. The craziest turbulence I've experienced in the last 10 years. Um, but I'm happy to be here, so... Lamu tamu kweli. Na huku hivi tunaongea ah 
unajua masala ya oil and gas unakuja uchimbaji wa mafuta unafanya nini na information inaenea haraka Faruk lazima tukupelekee nje ukaone kwa sababu kule kwetu ilikuwa ile oil yao wakianza kuchimba ilikuwa ukienda katika mikoko katika maana t-shirt yangu maana bana yangu kazi ndio nilianza ni 2011 sababu ukiona nchi zingine kama Nigeria wali hapo Niger Delta walipata mafuta lakini sasa wakapata mafuta alafu aje alikuwa anasema emergency preparedness haukuwa nayo sasa mafuta ilienda kwa maji masamaki walikufa wa mama walikuwa naenda kutembea kupata maji ya kuleta nyumbani hawawezi sababu hiyo maji sasa ni chafu so hiyo organization hii tunafanya ni kuongea na wamama na hata nyinyi mkiketi hapa lazima mfikirie wamama na wasichana sababu mafuta na hizi ma energy zina affect wamama kwanza before anybody else sababu usiku kama chakula inapikwa hiyo firewood una letwa nyumba ni mama na leta hiyo maji ni mama na leta so lazima ufikirie hizi industries zitafanyia wa mama aje alafu tunaweza keti hapa tunaweza ongea disaster preparedness kila kitu lakini lazima mkuwe na short term plans mid term plans na long term plans na hizo long term plans zinaweza kuwa kama mko na watoto wako shule saizi kama wako class 8 ama ni form 2 tunaenda around the country naongea na watu wasichana form 2 wanawaambia hizi subjects ma science physics chemistry mathematics inchi aje tunaenda na vision 2030 lazima tujipange vizuri utaki unaenda mtoto yako anaenda shule anamaliza shule lakini hawezi pata kazi tunataka in 10 years 5 years ma engineers wa hapo zarara ama wa hapa pate ni wa engineers wametoka nyumba zenu so it's important lazima tuongee na tuambie watu the importance ya kuingilia hizi subjects so hiyo ndio hiyo ndio yangu